All right, folks, this may be a surprise to a lot of people, but as you guys can see, I'm not on Windows. I'm on Linux for the first time in this channel, probably, uh, other than WSL. But this is what I want to show you. This is Cave Engine running natively on Linux. It's no Wine or anything like that. I've compiled that. I had some help, so I'll leave in the description the, the special thanks, um, and especially to the discord community from john jackson from mr frenic you guys are awesome and let's launch this bad boy uh it's work in progress so some stuff may not work as expected you can see here that i do have the project manager i can create projects i can open existing ones so let me open a boring one first and then i go to the more ex uh, interesting one and you can see that everything is working like the folders i can select hopefully the uh, the asset I can drag and drop. Oh, it's not working uh, because it does not get the material, but it's fine. Um, and everything here is working, including the scripting. So I can add my script here and it does have physics. So if I play the game, you can see that this is rotating like crazy, just as expected. And I can export this to a runtime, which is very good. So if I click here, export, there's this option here to export. Oh, I need to select the scene. Then export for for Linux. And if I click here, here we go. The game exported my game, which is the name of the project, of course. And if I double click it, I do have the game running as like a separate application application on Linux, which is pretty cool, right? Let me close this and open a more interesting file. And I forgot where is this? Is it here? No, yeah, here we go. Um, and why I'm doing this? This is a good question. Why I'm creating this for Linux? Well, first things first, I want the engine to work on Linux. But the other important thing is, oh, check this out, folks. This is like a huge project that we've been working on. This is Pixel Nightfall. I cannot spoil a lot uh, because this is like a serious project. But as you can see, let me disable the icons here. It is working. And this is like a huge thing. And we've been making this in, in um, on Windows and it works. I can like out of the box open this in Linux, which is fine. So the very first thing is we want the engine to be able to run on Windows or Linux. Sorry. So if you are using Linux, it will be good for you. And we want to be able to export a game for Linux as well. Uh, I'm not entirely sure yet how this will work, but it's work in progress. And as you can see, it's working very well at the moment. Uh, let me play the game for a second. Some stuff, I believe, does not work. Oh, it's working. Oh, nice. Oh, see, the font here, for some very weird reason, is not working, so I need to check this. But, anyways, everything is working. I cannot play the game much, so it will spoil everything. Oh, it crashed. Nice. Work in progress. <laughs> but the, the main reason why we want to do this is also because we also want to export the game for web using mscripting. And it turns out that using the, the Linux build is actually easier to port to mscripting than Visual Studio solution and the crazy .lib files and stuff like that. So I'm having a help of a Discord member. I don't know how to pronounce his name. Is Q, oh my God, it's even hard to say. Let me try, try to type here. Real quick, where's the terminal? Uh, I'll leave the link. I'll leave in the description. It's hard to pronounce the name. But the guy is being amazing and he wants to help me to create the script import so we can make uh, web games using Cave. And it will be honestly not very hard to finish this because it is already working on Linux and this guy is already working on building not only the engine but all the third parties as well such as bullet physics python and so on we are not uh shipping the game for web using a simp because it's not necessary uh, only in the editor and you won't be editing the game uh, for web just playing it um, and then like this is the main thing and the other main thing is like the OpenGL but Cave Engine already uses OpenGL uh, it is using OpenGL 4.3 just because of the debugging options that they have but everything in Cave is 3.3 and I made that on purpose to be able to export web 
easily easily because uh, web uses a webgl of course so it will be hopefully very easy to export this and maybe we will be able to make web games using cave and i'm very excited for that especially for ludendary uh, ludendary is coming it's less than i think a month and a half for now and i really want to participate using cave so this is another good reason i want to make a web game so you can play on your browser without having to download the game so that's gonna be pretty cool and this is one of the reasons as well uh so yeah folks this is the first day ever that the cave engine works fine like that on linux so i'm excited i wanted to show off to you guys a little bit this is something that people have been requesting me for a while and finally it's getting done so hope you guys enjoyed thanks for watching and let me know what in the comments what you think about that i see you in the next video bye